Ready? Okay. Hi, how are you doing? <laughs> uh, thank you very much. Uh, what's your name? Uh, TJ Gokce. And uh, what's the concept of these uh, designs today? Uh, Anadolu medeniyetlerinden ilhamını alan bir koleksiyon. Uh, ismi The Dead Rage. It was inspired by the civilizations in, uh, Anatol uh, in Turkey. Sekiz uh, medeniyetten oluşuyor. Uh, her bir medeniyetin bir kadın ve bir erkek uh, oku var. It is inspired by eight civilizations and each uh, civilization was represented by a male and female figure. Ve e, her bir medeniyeti de bir doku temsil ediyor. E, ha, deri, deri üzerinde farklı dokular e, la, e, daha hareketlendirmek ve o medeniyeti en doğru şekilde anlatmaya çalıştı. Uh, she tried to tell each uh, civilization on the texture and the, on the particular work of the leather that she worked. E, ve e, farklı teknikleri uyguladık deri üzerinde. E, Türk derisi kullanarak hazırlanmış bir koleksiyon bu. She used exclusive Turkish leather and she tried different techniques on leather. What's the importance of uh, having this uh, exhibition in Milan during Fashion Week? Yeah. What's the importance for you and what's the importance for the Turkish leather industry? Uh, it's very important for me. It's very important for me to be able to understand the design. It's a very important place in Milan. Uh, as a designer, it's an important uh, I, timing and an important event for her because uh, this uh, exhibition uh, exactly tells uh, her understanding of design. Ve Türk derisi için de çok önemli çünkü hem Türk derisinin derisinde hem tasarımcısıyla birlikte yapabileceklerini göstermek adına önemli bir event also important for the Turkish uh, leather because uh, this is a kind of show uh, to show our capacity as uh, rather than production but also in the design field. There's a lot of uh, different cuts, folds and uh, unique uh, patterns. I've never seen it in leather before. Uh, is it uh, very unique to the Turkish uh, market or is it something they're developing now? Türkiye'de dolar hiç görmediğim çalışma teknikleri var deri üzerinde. Bu özellikle Türkiye'de yapılan bir çalışma mı yoksa şu anda olan çalışmalar? Ee, bazıları var olan çalışmalar ama bazıları değil. Ee, yeni çalışmalar. Bu tamamen bir tasarımcının bütün e, modanı, modadan uzak bir e, biçimde e, tasarımı yeniden ele alış biçimi diyebiliriz aslında. Uh, some textures and the works on the leather are new, some are not. But uh, this is especially a kind of way of showing that this is not for commercial work, but this is, a, this is for design and art. Tasarım sürecini derinleştiren bir proje aslında, The Leather Age. Uh, the Leather Age is a kind of uh, way of be better. It's a better way of seeing uh, design and uh, art. So the history of uh, the Turkish uh, people, were they wearing leather during this civilization time? From the very beginning of the history, human uses uh, leather. But not in this way, of course. But some of the... Uh, but a kind of uh, citation to that period. So you're inspired by that period and you've developed the, the patterns and techniques from that, from your inspirations. Siz o zamandan ilham aldınız ve deri üzerinde bu çalışmaları mı gerçekleştirdiniz? Evet, yapmak istediğim deri üzerinde yeni tekniklerle hareketlendirmek ama oradan aldığım ilham da bunu yapabilmek aslında. Yes, exactly. Uh, my aim is to work on the leather, but the inspiration comes from that civilization. Is it a difficult material to work with when yes. you work with, when you're working? With, and why is it difficult? Deri gerçekten organik bir malzeme ve yaşayan ve eskimeyen bir malzeme. Doğal olarak onda bir şeyler yapmak ve bunun kalıcı olmasını sağlamak için çok doğru bir materyal. But you're not only. Uh, I noticed that this exhibition, for example, uh, you, you not only have leather. You've got some other components of leather, like there was a shoes with a, like a leather uh, fur, and you, this behind you have a. Uh, you have some other. Uh, 
çekti. Leather bike products like the inside, the cuff. Yani derinin türevinde olan ürünleri de kullanmışsınız diyor. Yok sadece deri kullan. What is this fabric here? Dune şey boyun deri. Boyun deri. Yes. But it looks, it's, it's, it's not your yes. concept of leather. Yes, yes. What I'm saying is, you know, when yes. someone looks at leather, they think it's the the leather of a coat or a bag. But it's leather, but it's not doesn't you know it's a different type of leather. Yeah, uh, there was a uh, like a two shoes. Hairy leather. Yeah. 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 Is there a retail side to this as well? Bunu yapmak istiyorum ve bunun ticari versiyonlarını da yapmaya başladım kendi koleksiyonlarımda kullanıyorum. Bu da kullandığım bütün teknikleri koleksiyonlarımda kullanıyorum. Ama tabii bunlar sadece sergilenme amacıyla yapılmış işler. She says that these are the pieces I want to realize for the exhibition, but she used those techniques for her collections as for her fans. Thank you very much. Beautiful collection. Thank you. 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 Thank you.